All right, so good question. What's your name? Dominic? Yeah. Dominic asked a good question. He was like, if we do go under that leg, can we open our hips and swing for the head? A absolutely. Okay. Um, probably the best example I've ever seen of that, that working. It was out of the crackdown position, but Coleman Scott pinned Joey Slayton in the NCAA finals with it. Um, and, and it's a good tactic out of a crackdown. This is what I want to think, this is what I want you to think about. Good leg riders usually have pretty good feel in a crackdown. And by crackdown, this is what I'm talking about. See that on a high crotch? Crackdown is here. All right. When I get to this position, so he's got his inside hip to the mat here. This is that crackdown position. Good leg riders are usually pretty comfortable here because they're good at sitting in the corner. Just say, keep your hip down. They're good at sitting in the corner and beating the shoulder, all right, and getting to this position. All right, this kind of crotch lock position. But this is what I want you to think about. Get back to crab ride. If he's real good in that area and can feel real good, again, I'm always thinking about what this guy's <coughs> contemplating. So we're doing a great job of cross raking and sealing and putting this guy out, getting my legs in. Um, and, and Buzzy asked a question. He was like, clear hands first or feet first? The way I think about it, this is his lifeline, right? So this is pretty important for him. If I take that away first, he's on a little bit more high alert, right? So if I take it away second, my feet are set. Take it away second. The minute it comes out, boom, I'm gone, right? So he doesn't have time to adjust. So small things like that strategically can play a big factor when I'm wrestling top level guys. So if I come here and come under the leg, and I get here under the leg like you guys are asking, again, I don't want to end up in a situation where I'm trying to turn, he's suiting the corner, or even getting here locking in the crotch and just waiting for a stalemate. Again, good leg riders know what the situation is, okay? And if he's getting out of whack and I've got his, got him beat here for a second, he might just take the stalemate and get a re restart. So those are the things that we need to think about. Now this is what Dominic was asking about. If I swim or if I hip highs here, then I can open up my hips, swim for the head, and then look for this bottom cradle right here. Okay? That's exactly you wanna watch, you wanna watch this in, at the highest level in folk style. Go find Coleman. He's a head coach at UNC now. He wrestled Oklahoma State at the time. Joey Slayton was an Iowa guy. Pinned him first period. Got in a little, got in a little leg attack situation, cracked him down, swam back, opened his hips up. Pin him in a bottom leg cradle. And this is a bottom leg cradle. Get on your hip. Bottom leg cradle, that should be a wrap. Every time you get this, should be a wrap. You should be able to pin every per person you put in a bottom leg cradle because it's real tough to get out of. Okay? So that's the main thing I want you to think about. All right? Anytime we're coming under that leg, you got to think about my arm might be entrapped. Now, we're going to get to this back trap situation. Everybody... I want everybody to lay flat on their back, and this is what I want you to think about. I want you to bring your heels as close to your butt as you can. Okay? Now I want you to just reach above your head and grab your own wrist. Okay? All right? I don't care if your right hand's grabbing your left wrist or your left hand's grabbing your right wrist. Now, I want you to focus on pushing your hips to the ceiling and then back towards your lock. So hips go to the ceiling, then back towards your lock, like you're doing a really high back bridge, okay? All right, and I want you to focus on pressuring forward and almost making your head slide across the mat. All right, my head slides pretty easy because it's sweaty and bald, but I want you to try forward, okay? Not just bridge. All right, relax. Now, if I can get my hips away far enough to get my, Dome of my head under their chin. That's what I want, okay? So again, all the same fundamentals here. He's got handles, I want my hips away, I've got to clear handles. So cross rake seal, cross rake seal. Feet in, feet in, okay? I'm gonna scoot here. Now, the minute I scoot, it's gonna be scoot, lock, okay? Scoot, lock. The reason why I wanna clear my feet is because if I don't, and he's still got a little piece of it, when I start to push back, he can start taking my legs out, okay? So I clear, clear, here, I scoot, and right when I scoot and get the end of my scoot, boom, tack the head. Now as I push back into him here, I'm trapping. And I'm trying to trap and hold here, all right? If he starts fishing and worming to a side, then just bail here. All right, bail out. Sometimes you'll catch them on their back. Sometimes you'll just get an escape. 
but it's hip separation for right when I get to the end of my hip separation, boom, I lock him in. That's what I want you to think about. I'm locking him in and then I'm trying to find his bottom of his chin with my head. I'm pulling his head and I'm trying to crush his head with my, the top of my head. All right, can I borrow somebody else so Ezra can see it? Somebody can borrow it. And we're still crab ride. We're still crab ride defense, all right? So he's got me in this crab ride position, nice and tight, cross rake seal, cross rake seal. Feet in, or whatever order you wanna do it. I'm scooting, attacking, right here. Scooting and attacking. Now I'm trying to find the bottom of his chin with my head as I drive back into him here, okay? Drive back into him here. Now, he's gonna start flopping around, pick a side, I'm hopping out. Now, I might end up here, and be able to put him on his back, or I might just end up out in front and get my escape. All right, just wrestle that position. There's no A, B, C, D, step one, two, three there. All right, but hips away, tack the back, find the bottom of his chin. Go, 